Welcome back to Brainwaves. In today's video, we're going to show you how to make your own YouTube channel. With over 2 billion active users, YouTube is not only a platform for entertainment but also a great way to share your passions, talents, and ideas with the world. Whether you're an aspiring content creator, a business owner looking to reach a wider audience, or just someone who wants to connect and engage with others who share similar interests, having your own YouTube channel is the perfect way to do so. So, let's dive in and learn all the steps to get you started on your YouTube journey. Welcome to the first step in making your own YouTube channel, choosing a niche or topic that you're passionate about. This is a crucial step as it sets the foundation for your content and determines the audience you'll attract. So, let's dive into section one, discover your passions and interests. 1.1 Explore your hobbies and areas of expertise. Think about the things you enjoy doing in your free time, whether it's cooking, gaming, fashion, or even giving life advice. Consider your skills, knowledge, and experiences that you can share with others. 1.2 Reflect on what you enjoy and want to share. Ask yourself what topics or activities make you truly excited and motivated. What do you want to educate and inspire others about? By aligning your channel with your genuine interests, you'll have the enthusiasm and dedication to create engaging content that resonates with your audience. Welcome to section 1.1. Explore your hobbies and areas of expertise. This step is all about diving into your passions and interests to discover potential topics for your YouTube channel. Let's get started. When exploring your hobbies, think about the activities that bring you joy and fulfillment. Do you love cooking delicious meals? Are you a skilled gamer who wants to share your gaming experiences? Maybe you have a keen sense of fashion and want to showcase your unique sense of style. It could even be that you have valuable life advice to offer based on your own personal experiences. Now, let's move on to areas of expertise. Consider the skills and knowledge you possess. Are you an expert in a particular field or have in-depth knowledge about a specific subject? For example, if you're an aspiring chef, you can create cooking tutorials and share your favorite recipes. If you're a tech enthusiast, you can review the latest gadgets or provide tech tips and tricks. By exploring both your hobbies and areas of expertise, you can identify the topics that truly spark your interest and allow you to utilize your skills to provide value to your audience. Now let's move on to section 1.2. Reflect on what you enjoy and want to share. This step is all about finding the perfect balance between your own interests and what you think will resonate with your audience. Let's dive deeper. When reflecting on what you enjoy, think about the topics and activities that truly ignite your passion. What brings you joy? What are the things you can talk about for hours without getting tired? It's important to choose a niche that aligns with your own genuine interests and values. This will not only make creating content more enjoyable for you, but also make it more authentic and engaging for your viewers. Next, consider what you want to share with your audience. What value can you provide? Do you want to entertain, educate, inspire, or all of the above? Think about the impact you want to make through your channel. Maybe you want to share your cooking skills and inspire others to embrace their inner chef. Or perhaps you want to offer life advice based on your own personal growth journey. Whatever it is, Make sure it's something you are truly passionate about sharing with others. Welcome to Section 2. Research popular niches on YouTube. It's important to understand what topics are already popular on the platform to help you make an informed decision about the niche for your channel. Let's dive in. 2.1 Look for trending topics in your chosen area. Explore YouTube and search for the keywords related to your interests. Take note of the videos that have high views, engagement, and a large number of subscribers. This can give you an idea of what topics are currently popular and have a potential audience. 2.2 Analyze successful channels in your niche. Study the channels that are already established in your chosen niche. Look at their content, presentation style, and how they engage with their audience. Take inspiration from their success while also finding your unique angle to differentiate yourself. 2.3 Identify underserved or unique subtopics. While researching popular niches, don't forget to pay attention to subtopics that might not have as much competition. 
These are areas where you can bring your unique perspective and cater to an audience seeking specific content that might not be readily available on YouTube. Welcome to Section 2.1. Look for trending topics in your chosen area. This step is all about staying up to date with the latest trends and discovering what content is in high demand on YouTube. Let's dig deeper. Start by exploring YouTube and searching for keywords related to your chosen area of interest. Look for videos that have a substantial number of views, likes, comments, and shares. These are indicators that the topic is currently trending and there is a potential audience interested in watching content related to it. Pay attention to the types of videos that are performing well within your chosen niche. Are there specific formats, styles, or angles that seem to resonate with viewers? Take note of these patterns and consider how you can incorporate them into your own content while keeping it unique and true to your vision. By staying informed about trending topics, you can identify popular content ideas and ensure that your channel aligns with what viewers are currently interested in. Now let's move on to section 2.2, analyze successful channels in your niche. This step is all about learning from the channels that have already achieved success in your chosen niche. Let's dive deeper. Start by identifying the top channels in your niche. Look for channels that have a significant number of subscribers, high view counts, and active engagement in the form of comments, likes, and shares. These channels are proof that there is an interested audience for the content you want to create. Next, analyze the content and presentation styles of these successful channels. Pay attention to how they structure their videos, the length of their videos, the topics they cover, and the overall quality of their production. Take inspiration from their techniques while also considering how you can put your own unique spin on things to stand out from the crowd. Additionally, explore how these channels engage with their audience. Look at their comments section, social media presence, and any other ways they interact with their viewers. Take note of the types of content that receive the most engagement and learn from their strategies in building a loyal community. By analyzing successful channels, you can gain valuable insights into what works and what resonates with viewers in your niche. Welcome to Section 2.3. Identify underserved or unique subtopics. This step is all about finding areas within your chosen niche that are not already saturated with content. Let's dive in. While researching popular niches, keep an eye out for subtopics that might not have as much competition. These are areas where you can bring your unique perspective and cater to an audience seeking specific content that might not be readily available on YouTube. For example, if you're interested in cooking, instead of starting a generic cooking channel, you could focus on a specific cuisine, dietary restriction, or cooking techniques that are not extensively covered by existing channels. By catering to a narrower or underserved subtopic, you can carve out your own space and attract a dedicated audience who are passionate about that niche. Similarly, in gaming, instead of covering the most popular games, you could explore lesser-known indie games, niche genres, or specific gaming strategies that haven't received much attention. This can help you stand out and attract a dedicated community interested in those unique subtopics. By identifying underserved or unique subtopics within your niche, you can differentiate yourself and offer valuable content that fills a specific need in the YouTube ecosystem. Welcome to Section 3. Evaluate the potential of your chosen niche. Once you have identified your passion and niche, it is important to assess the viability and sustainability of your chosen niche. Let's explore this step further. 3.1 Consider the audience size and engagement. Look into the size of the audience interested in your chosen niche. Are there enough people actively searching for and consuming content related to your niche? Evaluate the engagement levels on existing channels, such as the number of comments, likes, and shares, to gauge the level of interest and interaction within the audience. 3.2 Assess market competition and saturation. Research how many channels already exist in your niche and analyze their quality and content. If your chosen niche is overcrowded with high-quality channels, it may be challenging to stand out. Consider if there is space for another channel or if you need to find a unique angle, specialized knowledge, or a different approach to differentiate yourself. 3.3 Determine your ability to consistently create content in the niche. 
Evaluate your own commitment, availability, and expertise in the chosen niche. Creating a successful YouTube channel requires regular content creation, so consider if you have the time, resources, and passion to consistently produce videos that meet the expectations of your audience. By evaluating the potential of your chosen niche, you can make an informed decision that aligns with your goals and sets you up for success. Welcome to Section 3.1, Consider the Audience Size and Engagement. In this step, we'll explore how to assess the potential audience for your chosen niche and understand their level of engagement. Let's dive in. Start by researching the size of the audience interested in your chosen niche. Look for online communities, forums, or social media groups related to your niche. Observe the level of activity, the number of followers or members, and the overall interest and engagement within these platforms. This will give you an idea of the potential size of your target audience. Next, analyze the engagement levels on existing YouTube channels in your niche. Take note of the number of views, likes, comments, and shares on videos related to your topic. High engagement suggests a strong interest in the content and indicates that there is an active and responsive audience within your niche. Evaluate the growth potential of your target audience as well. Are there emerging trends or increasing interest in your niche? Consider if the audience size is likely to expand in the future, allowing for more opportunities to reach and engage with viewers. By considering the audience size and engagement, you can gain valuable insights into the potential reach and interest in your chosen niche. Let's move on to Section 3.2, Assess Market Competition and Saturation. In this step, we'll delve into understanding the level of competition and saturation in your chosen niche. Let's explore, start by researching existing YouTube channels in your niche. Look for channels that cover similar topics or cater to a similar audience. Analyze the quality of their content, their presentation style, and the level of engagement they receive. This will give you an idea of the competition you might face when entering the market. Consider the number of channels already established in your niche. If there are numerous high-quality channels with a substantial following, it may indicate a saturated market. However, don't let this discourage you. Instead, look for ways to differentiate yourself by finding a unique angle, exploring uncharted subtopics, or bringing a fresh perspective to the niche. Evaluate the strength of your competition as well. Assess the content gaps that exist within the existing channels. Find areas where you can offer something new or provide a better experience for viewers. Understanding the weaknesses and strengths of your competitors can guide you in positioning your own channel effectively. By assessing the market competition and saturation, you can develop a strategy to stand out and carve your own space within your chosen niche. Welcome to Section 3.3, Determine Your Ability to Consistently Create Content in the Niche. This step is all about evaluating your own commitment, availability, and expertise in your chosen niche. Let's dive in. Consider your level of passion and interest in the niche. Creating YouTube content requires dedication and enthusiasm, so choose a niche that aligns with your genuine interests and values. This will make it easier for you to consistently create content and maintain your motivation over the long term. Assess your availability and resources. Creating quality content takes time and effort. Consider your schedule and commitments to determine if you can consistently allocate sufficient time for research, planning, filming, editing, and promoting your videos. Additionally, assess the resources you have at your disposal, such as equipment, software, or assistance, to ensure you can meet the production demands of your chosen niche. Evaluate your expertise or willingness to learn. While it's not essential to be an expert from the start, having a certain level of knowledge or a willingness to learn and grow within the niche is important. Your audience will appreciate your expertise or your journey of improvement over time. By honestly assessing your ability to consistently create content, you can set realistic expectations and ensure that you're ready to commit to the demands of building and maintaining a successful YouTube channel. Welcome to Section 2.1, Create a Google Account. In order to access and manage your YouTube channel, you'll need a Google account since YouTube is owned by Google. If you already have a Google account, feel free to skip ahead to the next step. Let's get started. 
2.1.1 Why do you need a Google account for YouTube? A Google account is essential for creating, customizing, and managing your YouTube channel. It allows you to upload videos, interact with your audience, and access various features and settings related to your channel and content. 2.1.2 How to create a new Google account If you don't already have a Google account, creating one is quick and simple. Here's how. Open your web browser and go to the Google account creation page. Click on the Create Account button. Provide the necessary information, including your first and last name, desired email address, password, and phone number. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the account creation process. 2.1.3 Signing into YouTube with your Google account Once you have created your Google account, you can easily sign into YouTube with your credentials. Simply go to youtube.com, click on the Sign In button, enter your Google account email and password, and you'll have access to your YouTube channel. By creating a Google account, you ensure seamless access to the full range of features and functionalities that YouTube has to offer. Welcome to Section 2.1.1. Why do you need a Google account for YouTube? Having a Google account is crucial for accessing and managing your YouTube channel. Let's explore the reasons why. 1. Seamless integration. YouTube is owned by Google, which means a Google account provides seamless integration with the platform. Using a Google account allows you to easily navigate between various Google services, such as Gmail, Google Drive, and Google Analytics, while managing your YouTube content. 2. Uploading videos. A Google account is necessary for uploading videos to your YouTube channel. By signing in with your Google account, you gain the ability to upload, edit, and manage your videos in a user-friendly and convenient manner. 3. Interacting with the community. Engaging with your audience is an essential aspect of running a successful YouTube channel. With a Google account, you can like, comment on, and reply to comments on your videos, as well as connect with other creators and subscribers in the YouTube community. 4. Channel Customization. Your Google account provides access to a range of customization options for your YouTube channel. This includes the ability to create a channel art banner, add a channel trailer, set up playlists, and customize the appearance and branding of your channel. By having a Google account, you unlock a world of possibilities for managing and growing your YouTube channel, making it an essential requirement for any aspiring content creator. Welcome to Section 2.1.2 how to create a new Google account. If you don't have a Google account yet, fret not. I'll guide you through the process step by step. Let's get started. 1. Open your web browser and go to the Google account creation page. 2. Click on the Create Account button to begin the account creation process. 3. You'll be prompted to enter some personal information. Start by providing your first and last name in the respective fields. 4. Next, you'll need to choose an email address for your Google account. You can either create a new Gmail address or use your existing email by selecting the Use my current email address instead option. 5. Set a strong password for your Google account. Make sure it's secure and unique to protect your account. 6. Enter your phone number, which can be used for account verification and account recovery purposes. 7. Google may ask for additional information, like your birth date and gender. Feel free to fill in these details according to your preference or skip them if you don't want to disclose that information. 8. Finally, review and accept the Terms of Service and Privacy Policy, then click on the Next button. Congratulations! You have successfully created your new Google account. You can now use this account to access and manage your YouTube channel. Welcome to Section 2.1.3, Signing into YouTube with your Google account. Now that you have a Google account, let's explore how you can sign into YouTube and gain access to your channel. 1. Open your web browser and go to youtube.com. 2. Once you're on the YouTube homepage, click on the Sign In button located at the top right corner of the page. 3 you'll be redirected to a sign-in page where you can enter your Google account email and password. 4. 
Type in your email address associated with your Google account and click on the Next button. 5. Enter your Google account password in the provided field, ensuring that it is correctly entered. 6. If you're using a personal device and want to stay signed in to your Google account, you can select the Stay Signed In checkbox. However, it's recommended to only do this on trusted devices. 7. Once you've entered your email and password correctly, click on the Next button to sign in to YouTube with your Google account. Congratulations! You're now signed in to your YouTube channel and ready to start creating and managing content. Welcome to Section 3.1. Go to YouTube and sign in with your Google account. In this step, we'll walk you through the process of accessing YouTube and signing in with your Google account. Let's get started. 3.1.1 Accessing YouTube To begin, open your web browser and type youtube.com in the address bar. Hit enter, and you will be directed to the YouTube homepage. 3.1.2 Signing in with your Google account Look for the sign in button located at the top right corner of the page. Click on it to initiate the sign-in process. You'll be redirected to a sign-in page where you can enter your Google account email and password. Type in your credentials and click the Next button to proceed. Once you've successfully signed in, you will have access to your personalized YouTube interface and be ready to proceed to the next step. Welcome to Section 3.1.1, Accessing YouTube. Once you're ready to create your own YouTube channel, the first step is to access the YouTube website. Here's how you can do it. 1. Open your web browser of choice. 2. In the address bar at the top, type youtube.com. 3. Press enter, and you will be directed to the YouTube homepage. 4. Take a moment to familiarize yourself with the various sections and features available on the YouTube homepage. This will give you a better understanding of the platform's layout and navigation options. Now that you have successfully accessed YouTube, it's time to sign in with your Google account and proceed to the next step. Let's continue with the sign-in process. Welcome to Section 3.1.2, Signing in with your Google account. Now that you've accessed YouTube, let's guide you through the process of signing in with your Google account. 1. Look for the Sign In button located at the top right corner of the YouTube homepage. It usually appears as a blue button. 2. Click on the Sign In button. You will be redirected to a Sign In page. 3. On the Sign In page, you'll see a field where you can enter your Google account email. Type in the email address associated with your Google account. 4. Once you've entered your email, click on the Next button to proceed. 5. Now, you'll need to enter the password for your Google account. You can type it in the provided field and ensure it is correctly entered. 6. After entering your password, click on the Next button to sign in. Congratulations! You have successfully signed in to YouTube with your Google account. You now have access to your personalized YouTube interface. Welcome to Section 3.2, clicking on the profile icon and accessing Create a Channel. Now that you are signed into YouTube, let's proceed with creating your own YouTube channel by following these steps. 3.2.1 Locating the profile icon Look for the profile icon at the top right corner of the YouTube interface. It is usually represented as a circular image or your profile picture. 3.2.2 Clicking on the profile icon Click on the profile icon to open a drop-down menu. This menu provides access to various personalized options for your YouTube account. 3.2.3 Selecting the Create a Channel option in the drop-down menu, you'll find the Create a Channel option. Click on it to initiate the channel creation process. You may be asked to provide some additional information and agree to YouTube's terms and policies. By clicking on the profile icon and selecting Create a Channel, you are taking the next step towards establishing your own YouTube presence. Welcome to Section 3.2.1, Locating the Profile Icon. In order to proceed with creating your own YouTube channel, let's first find the profile icon on the YouTube interface. 1. Look towards the top right corner of the YouTube homepage or any other page within the YouTube website. 2. 
Search for a circular image or an icon that represents your profile. This icon typically consists of a small image or your profile picture. 3. The profile icon is usually located adjacent to the search bar, near the notification bell, and other navigation options. By locating the profile icon, you're one step closer to creating your YouTube channel. Let's move on to the next step of clicking on the profile icon and accessing the Create a Channel option. Welcome to Section 3.2.2, Clicking on the Profile Icon. Once you have located the profile icon on the YouTube interface, let's proceed with the next step of clicking on it. 1. Position your cursor over the profile icon, and you will notice that it becomes highlighted or displays a tooltip indicating its function. 2. Click on the profile icon to open a drop-down menu. This menu provides access to various personalized options for your YouTube account. 3. Take a moment to explore the options available in the drop-down menu. You might find settings related to your channel, subscriptions, playlists, and more. By clicking on the profile icon, you will gain access to a range of features and settings that will allow you to customize and manage your YouTube channel. Welcome to Section 3.2.3, Selecting the Create a Channel option. After clicking on the profile icon, it's time to proceed with creating your YouTube channel by following these steps. 1. In the drop-down menu that appears after clicking on the profile icon, look for the option labeled, Create a Channel. 2. Click on the, Create a Channel, option to initiate the channel creation process. 3. Depending on your account settings, you may be asked to provide additional information such as your channel name, category, and personalization preferences. 4. Make sure to carefully fill in all the required details and agree to YouTube's terms and policies to successfully create your channel. By selecting the Create a Channel option, you are taking a significant step towards establishing your own YouTube presence and sharing your content with the world. Welcome to Section 4.1. Choose a name for your channel. The name of your YouTube channel plays a significant role in representing your content and establishing your brand. Let's explore this step in more detail. 4.1.1 Importance of a channel name Your channel name is the first impression viewers have of your content. It should be memorable, unique, and reflective of the type of content you create. 4.1.2 Reflecting your content and brand Consider the topic or theme of your channel and try to incorporate relevant keywords or phrases into your channel name. This will help potential viewers understand what your channel is all about and attract the right audience. Take your time to brainstorm and come up with a channel name that aligns with your content, values, and long-term goals. A well-thought-out channel name can make a lasting impact on your viewers and help build a strong brand identity. Welcome to Section 4.1.1, Importance of a Channel Name. The name you choose for your YouTube channel plays a crucial role in capturing the attention of potential viewers and establishing your brand identity. Let's dive deeper into why a channel name is important. Having a memorable channel name helps viewers easily identify and remember your channel. A catchy and relevant name can make a strong first impression and attract more viewers. The channel name also sets the tone for your content. It gives viewers an idea of what to expect from your videos. For example, if you have a channel about cooking, a name like Flavorsome Kitchen or Gourmet Delights instantly communicates your channel's focus. Additionally, a well-chosen channel name can improve your discoverability on YouTube. When users search for content related to your channel's niche, a unique and descriptive channel name can help your videos appear higher in search results. Remember to keep your channel name concise, easy to spell, and relevant to your content. Take time to brainstorm and choose a name that accurately represents your brand and resonates with your target audience. Welcome to Section 4.1.2, Reflecting Your Content and Brand. When choosing a name for your YouTube channel, it's important to consider how it reflects your content and brand. Let's delve into this further. Your channel name should give viewers an immediate understanding of what your content is about. If your channel focuses on fitness, a name like Fit Life Adventures or Fitness Fusion can convey that message. Consider the tone and image you want to project. 
If your content is educational, a professional sounding name like Knowledge Hub or Academy Explorers can instill confidence in viewers. Your channel name should also align with your brand identity. Reflect your unique personality and values through your channel name. If you want to create a channel centered around positivity and motivation, a name like Inspire Uplift or Positive Vibe Studio can establish that brand image. It's essential to strike a balance between creativity, relevance, and brand consistency when choosing your channel's name. Take some time to brainstorm ideas that accurately represent both your content and the image you want to portray to viewers. Welcome to Section 4.2, Upload a Channel Icon and Banner. Customizing the visual elements of your YouTube channel is crucial for creating an attractive and memorable brand. Let's explore this step in detail. 4.2.1 Importance of Visual Appeal A visually appealing channel can capture the attention of viewers and leave a lasting impression. It helps in creating a cohesive and professional look for your brand. 4.2.2 Channel Icon The channel icon is a small image that represents your channel across YouTube. It appears next to your channel name in search results, comments, and on your channel page. Choose an icon that visually represents your brand, such as a logo or an image related to your content. 4.2.3 Channel Banner The channel banner is a large image that sits at the top of your channel page. It's a great opportunity to showcase your brand, share your channel's tagline or slogan, and provide a glimpse of the content viewers can expect. Use high-quality images or design elements that align with your channel's theme. By uploading a channel icon and banner, you can create an inviting and visually consistent experience for your viewers and make a strong brand statement. Welcome to Section 4.2.1, Importance of Visual Appeal. When it comes to customizing your YouTube channel, visual elements play a crucial role in creating an appealing and memorable brand. Let's dive deeper into why visual appeal is important. A visually appealing channel captures the attention of potential viewers. In a crowded platform like YouTube, having visually appealing elements can make your channel stand out from the rest. Visual appeal also helps in establishing a professional image for your brand. By presenting a well-designed and cohesive channel, you instill confidence in viewers and make them more likely to engage with your content. Consistency in visual elements creates brand recognition. When your channel icon, banner, colors, and overall design align with your content and brand identity, viewers can easily recognize and associate your channel with your content, even outside of YouTube. Investing time and effort into creating visually appealing channel elements can make a significant impact on the success of your YouTube channel. It's an opportunity to showcase your creativity, professionalism, and dedication to providing high-quality content. Welcome to Section 4.2.2, Channel Icon. Your channel icon is a key visual element that represents your YouTube channel. Let's explore its significance. The channel icon appears next to your channel name in various places across YouTube, such as search results, comments, and on your channel page. It serves as a visual identifier for your brand, helping viewers recognize and associate your channel with your content. When choosing a channel icon, consider using a recognizable image that reflects your content or represents your brand. It can be a logo, a symbol, or an image that is relevant to your niche. The goal is to create an icon that viewers can easily connect with your channel. It's important to keep in mind that the channel icon will appear in small sizes, so choose a design that is simple, clear, and easy to identify, even when scaled down. Also, ensure that the colors and style of your channel icon align with your overall branding. By selecting an appropriate channel icon, you can enhance the visual appeal of your channel and reinforce your brand's identity. Welcome to Section 4.2.3, Channel Banner. Your channel banner is a prominent visual element that appears at the top of your channel page. Let's explore its importance in more detail. The channel banner provides an excellent opportunity to make a strong visual statement about your channel. It serves as a virtual storefront, giving viewers a glimpse into your content and brand. When designing your channel banner, consider incorporating elements that align with your content and brand identity. Use high-quality images or striking visuals that captivate viewers' attention and convey the essence of your channel. 
You can also include your channel's tagline or slogan in the banner to communicate your channel's unique selling points or to create a memorable phrase that resonates with your audience. Remember to pay attention to the dimensions and guidelines provided by YouTube to ensure your channel banner displays correctly on different devices. By creating an eye-catching and well-designed channel banner, you can make a lasting impression on viewers and entice them to explore your content further. Welcome to Section 4.3. Fill out the About section. The About section of your YouTube channel is a vital space where you can introduce your channel to viewers and provide them with valuable information. Let's explore why filling out this section is essential. 4.3.1 Importance of the About section The About section gives viewers a glimpse into what your channel is all about, your content niche, and why they should subscribe. It's an opportunity to connect with your audience on a deeper level and build a loyal community. 4.3.2 Describing your channel in the About section, clearly explain the purpose and focus of your channel. Share what type of content you create, what viewers can expect, and why your channel is unique. Use compelling language to captivate and engage viewers. 4.3.3 Engaging with viewers encourage viewers to interact by inviting them to comment, subscribe, and join your community. Let them know how they can benefit from being a part of your channel and the value you provide. Take the time to craft a well-written about section that reflects your channel's personality, voice, and goals. It's an essential tool for attracting your target audience and encouraging viewers to become subscribers. Welcome to Section 4.3.1, Importance of the About section. The About section of your YouTube channel is a crucial space that holds immense value. Let's explore why it's important. The About section allows you to introduce your channel to viewers and provide key information about your content. It serves as a snapshot of what your channel offers and why viewers should subscribe. When viewers stumble upon your channel, the About section is often their first point of reference. It helps them quickly understand your channel's purpose, niche, and the value you provide. A well-crafted about section can pique their interest and encourage them to explore your content further. Moreover, the about section is an opportunity to establish your credibility and build trust with your audience. By sharing your expertise, credentials, or experience in the relevant field, you can instill confidence in viewers and position yourself as knowledgeable and reliable. Remember to keep your about section concise, engaging, and informative. Use language that resonates with your target audience and clearly communicates your channel's unique value proposition. By investing time in crafting an appealing about section, you can effectively convert casual viewers into loyal subscribers. Welcome to section 4.3.2, describing your channel. The about section of your YouTube channel is a valuable opportunity to clearly communicate the purpose, focus, and uniqueness of your content. Let's dive deeper into this step. When describing your channel, it's essential to convey what type of content you create and what viewers can expect. Explain the topics you cover, the format of your videos, and any specific themes or series you offer. This helps viewers determine if your channel aligns with their interests. Consider highlighting your channel's unique selling points. What sets your content apart from others in the same niche? Do you offer a fresh perspective? expert advice, or entertaining storytelling. Communicate these distinctive qualities to captivate viewers and entice them to explore your channel. Use captivating language in a tone that resonates with your target audience. Whether your content is educational, comedic, inspirational, or something else entirely, make sure your description reflects the vibe and personality of your channel. Lastly, don't forget to invite viewers to subscribe, engage with your content, and become part of your community. Let them know the benefits of being a subscriber and how they can benefit from your channel's content. Crafting an enticing and informative about section helps attract the right audience to your channel and sets clear expectations for what viewers can find in your content. Welcome to section 4.3.3, Engaging with Viewers. Building a strong connection with your audience is key to growing your YouTube channel. Let's explore ways to engage with viewers in your About section. Encourage viewers to interact by inviting them to comment, share their thoughts, and ask questions. Let them know that their opinions and feedback are valued and appreciated. 
Responding to comments and engaging in discussions helps foster a sense of community and makes viewers feel heard. Consider including a call to action in your About section. This could be a request for viewers to subscribe to your channel, join your social media platforms, or sign up for a newsletter. Let them know how they can stay connected with you beyond YouTube. Another effective way to engage with viewers is by organizing occasional contests, giveaways, or challenges related to your content. This creates excitement and incentivizes viewers to participate and share your channel with others. Remember to create a welcoming and inclusive environment where viewers feel comfortable expressing their opinions. Encourage healthy and respectful discussions, and moderate your comments section to maintain a positive atmosphere. By actively engaging with viewers in your About section and throughout your channel, you can cultivate a loyal and dedicated community that supports your content. Welcome to Section 5, Start Uploading Videos. Now that you have customized your YouTube channel, it's time to share your content with the world. Let's explore the process. When you're ready to upload a video, click on the Upload button located in the top right corner of your YouTube homepage. This will take you to the upload interface where you can start the process of adding your video. Before you upload, it's essential to optimize your videos to maximize their reach and visibility. One of the key optimization techniques is to add relevant titles, tags, and descriptions to your videos. When choosing a title, make it descriptive, concise, and catchy. Include keywords that accurately represent the content of your video, making it easier for viewers to discover your content through search. Next, add tags to your video. These are keywords or phrases that are related to your video's topic. They help YouTube understand the context of your video and recommend it to relevant viewers. Don't forget to write a compelling and informative description for your video. Describe what viewers can expect, provide additional context or background information, and include relevant links or references if necessary. By optimizing your video's titles, tags, and descriptions, you increase the chances of attracting viewers who are interested in your content. This optimization process is crucial for organic discoverability and growing your audience on YouTube. Welcome to Section 5.1. Click on the Upload button. Once you're ready to share your videos with the world, it's time to click on the Upload button. Let's explore this step. To start uploading a video, navigate to your YouTube homepage and locate the Upload button. It is usually located in the top right corner of the page. Clicking on this button will take you to the upload interface. In the upload interface, you will have the option to select the video file from your computer or drag and drop it into the designated area. YouTube supports various video formats, so make sure your video meets the platform's requirements, including the file size and format. Once you have selected your video, you will have the opportunity to add additional details, such as the video title, description, tags, and more. We will explore these optimization techniques in the next section. After entering the necessary information, you can choose whether to make your video public, private, or unlisted. Public videos are visible to anyone. Private videos are only accessible to users you authorize, and unlisted videos are not searchable but can be shared with others through a direct link. Remember to review all the details before uploading to ensure accuracy and consistency with your overall content strategy. By clicking on the Upload button, you take the first step towards sharing your content and reaching your audience on YouTube. Welcome to Section 5.2. Optimize your videos with relevant titles, tags, and descriptions. To attract viewers and increase the discoverability of your videos, it's important to optimize them with the right information. Let's dive into the details. The title of your video is one of the most critical elements for optimization, Choose a title that accurately represents the content of the video and is enticing to potential viewers. Include relevant keywords that people might search for when looking for content like yours. Tags are another essential aspect of optimization. These are keywords or short phrases that help YouTube understand the context and content of your video. Choose tags that are relevant to your video's topic and reflect what viewers might search for. Consider using a combination of specific tags and broader tags to cover different search queries. In addition to titles and tags, writing a compelling and informative description is crucial. 
Use this space to provide more details about the video, including a summary of its content, key points, and any relevant links or references to external sources. Make sure to include your target keywords naturally within the description. Remember that optimizing your videos not only helps with search rankings but also improves the overall viewing experience for your audience. By providing accurate and relevant titles, tags, and descriptions, you increase the chances of attracting viewers who are genuinely interested in your content. Welcome to Section 5.3. Attract viewers by using effective optimization techniques. Once you have optimized your videos with relevant titles, tags, and descriptions, it's time to focus on attracting viewers to your content. Let's explore some techniques. One effective way to attract viewers is to create eye-catching and engaging thumbnails for your videos. Thumbnails are the small images that viewers see before clicking on a video. Use high-quality images, bold text, and vibrant colors to make your thumbnails visually appealing. Make sure the thumbnail accurately represents the content of the video and entices viewers to click. Promote your videos on your other social media platforms. Utilize platforms like Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook to share snippets, teasers, or behind-the-scenes content from your YouTube videos. Include a call to action encouraging your followers to watch the full video on your YouTube channel. Collaborate with other YouTubers or influencers in your niche. Collaborations can introduce your channel to a new audience and help you gain more visibility. Find creators who share a similar target audience and work together on mutually beneficial projects, such as guest appearances, interviews, or joint videos. Lastly, engage with your viewers by responding to comments, creating polls, and encouraging discussion. Building a sense of community around your content encourages viewers to return for more and enhances loyalty. By implementing these optimization techniques and actively promoting your videos, you can attract more viewers and grow your YouTube channel. And there you have it. You have successfully learned how to make your own YouTube channel. Remember, building a successful channel takes time, effort, and dedication. It's important to create high-quality content, engage with your audience, and consistently upload new videos to keep your channel active. Don't be discouraged if you don't see immediate success. Building a loyal subscriber base takes time. Stay consistent, explore different video ideas, and always listen to your viewers' feedback. YouTube is a platform that allows you to express yourself, share your knowledge, and connect with people from all around the world. So, go ahead and start creating amazing content on your new YouTube channel. We hope this video has been helpful in getting you started on your YouTube journey. Thank you for watching Brainwaves. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more informative videos.